Hello and welcome to the Legends tier list. I'm joined by Hecarellus Major. Today we're doing the, like I just fucking said, the tier list of the uh, Apex Legends. And the first one of which is Ash. Oh, you don't uh, want to go in order of like. We can go in order of um, like how it is the on original. the list. Yeah, it's like all out of order on there. Yeah, I think the first one on that is Blood. How do we feel about Blood? I think Blood is viable no matter what. Yeah, Blood has always been a solid legend. Yeah. I, Even I before his buff. Yeah, I don't know if he's, like... Like, I know a lot of pros use him, but I don't know if he's, like, really, like, team comp, like, ranked worthy, you know what I mean? Yeah, I saw someone was saying that he's not, like, viable for comp, which I honestly don't get. Like, why, well, cause, like, why would he not it's, I think it's just, like... You're, are you gonna choose blood on your team or Gibby? You know what I mean? Like blood on I your guess. team or Gibby or Lifeline or uh, movement. Someone said that Lifeline comp. wasn't viable for comp either. Okay, yeah, they're completely wrong. I feel like that's totally viable. So in my opinion, pubs wise, carries him a long way because he's one really fun to play and two, uh, super viable for the team at least in pubs. So I think that I think he's a. good both in pubs and rank, but I don't know about like actual competition. Yeah, that's why I think he gets as far as an A for sure. Yeah, just not just not yet an S. I can agree uh, with that. The next I think was actually Gibby. So Gibby. <sighs> my heart wants to say F tier. Yeah, but. I hate him with I a guess. burning passion, but he's good, and he's always been good. He's never not going to be good, so unfortunately... His fucking gun shield is ridiculously broken. Yeah, it's so fucking bad. I saw it completely stops Ash's tactical, her little arc snare. Like, if Seriously? it hits dead on, it just doesn't do anything. Are you fucking kidding me? That's ridiculous. Yeah. Now, you know, they, I think they're actually nerfing the Arc Stars uh, this season. So, like, the if you Arc get, Stars? yeah, so it does like ten damage when you stick someone instead of like forty. I think. I and thought I saw it was getting like, a buff. I don't. I don't know. I have to look at it again. Um, oh. I'm pretty sure. Like, I'm pretty sure it is a nerf, though. But yeah, Gibby's always gonna be S tier. So like. Like I was saying with the Arc Stars, like it's if they're getting nerfed, it's just like don't throw Arc Stars at Gibby, it's fucking useless. Yeah. Um Who is next? Lifeline, I believe. Lifeline, I actually think is an S tier. I think she's both viable in comp and is fun um, to play as in pubs. I literally, because of Alyssa, like it's hard not to play with a lifeline. Right, I mean, what? Do, how do you feel about how they took away her res shield? I think it was a balance. I mean, I feel like they need to do something to give you to even it out a little bit more. But yeah. like someone said, like do. it, the the shield just like gives away your position or whatever. Well, not but only like, that. Well, I mean, like she played the shield a lot, and I was like, "What the point was is that it was like super cool because like you can just keep spamming reses and play the shield, just like yeah. you would as like a Gibby or something like that," which I thought was really good. But I also like the uh, nerf slash buff uh, with one her care package and just two she can. I don't know if she could always dual res. I I can never remember, but uh, um, like. She uses her drone to res one, and then she herself reses another. Right. So she. Yeah. So now she can dual res, which is pretty nice. Dual AFK. Could she res. always. I feel like she always could. I can't remember, but I, I like I'm saying though. I think Lifeline is genuinely an S tier simply because like I literally can't see myself not playing with the Lifeline. Mm -hmm. So. Yeah, it's pretty I, damn I useful. Guess. Yeah. Unless you're Alyssa. Um who's I think it's Wraith after that, right? I think it's Wraith. Uh, yeah, Wraith and then what Octane, then Watson. Yeah, or no. 
Wraith, then Path, then Octane Watson, Caustic. So this is what I'm yeah. going to say the about Wraith. Wraith. This is what I'm going to say about Wraith. Wraith is not nearly as good as she used to be, and I don't think... I, I feel like uh, she's only good because there's like god-tier players playing her still. And I love Wraith. I, you know I fucking love Wraith. I literally have a tattoo um, on my video right now of her kunai and her. Uh, but I don't think she's S-tier anymore. No. Nope. I feel like there's enough I'd movement like in Apex B, Legends honestly. to like... B, really? Yeah, because I don't... She's not... Like, she's not that useful, really. Like, her hitbox is small. Yeah, right. that makes her... That's a plus for her. And she but, can get away from a situation with her Q, which I think yes, is Yes, but her Q takes forever to wind up, which right. pisses me off. Um, like, yeah, you move faster in it, and, like, they, they shortened the amount of time it lasts, right? Yeah. So, like, it, yeah. I think it lasts... I think it... Either that... So, I know they made her portal length shorter. They, oh, they made it shorter? The portal length is short, yeah. I from, thought it was like the, the, that was like her last nerf was wow. was the uh wind up and the portal. Hmm. That's the last time they touched Wraith. And right. like it's okay. I mean uh, I think I think Wraith could use a little bit of love. I think we can like with all these new legends, we could definitely go back to an older Wraith. I honestly don't really understand the portal thing at the very least. Like, I feel like the portal is too short to do a whole, whole lot. Yeah, um, portal takes forever to what, recharge. Yeah, that too. I don't yeah. know why it takes so long for her portal to charge. That's weird because Ashes charges like crazy fast. So honestly, yeah. I love her so much. But I, I think B. Yeah. Yeah. But one thing about her portal though that is very useful is the whole like zone hacking thing like at the final circle yeah like, yeah, I like, like we've that. pulled off a win with that before and you can't do that with ash yeah no i which i think is hilarious i i, I just remembered that right now when you said it that was mm -hmm. really fun oh fuck yeah. i accidentally skipped over pathfinder i forgot he was on that top row i i said pathfinder after wraith so yeah path yeah path <laughs> Um, um, I'm not. I don't think Path is that good. I think I he's think good he... for like getting someone low and then chasing them immediately. But I don't think he's like good otherwise. That that's what makes him so good, I guess. Like, like you can fucking chase someone with him. Like him and Octane, I think are kind of. I wouldn't say on par. Octane's obviously going to be better at chasing. Right. But that zip makes it pretty fucking easy. Like, say you're, like, kind of far from a building, and you laser someone, and then, you like, just they, just, right over. they just barely get away from it. You just zip right up to them. Right. Fucking just nail the bitch. Still, though, that makes I don't think he's, like... His ultimate, his zip line. It's, I'd say it's very useful. It doesn't take too long to recharge. Right? It doesn't. Uh, his, his ult doesn't know, but his zip is dependent on how far you go when you zip. Yeah. Um, honestly, though, like, his passive is, like, non-existent, pretty much. Like, if you scan a beacon, I think your Q and your ult get charged more. But I think right. your Q is immediately back or something. But that's yeah, I don't know such shit a lame, about his That's such a lame fucking passive. Like, they need to do something for this guy. So I honestly want to put him at C. Yeah, I'd say B or C. Uh, yeah. Mirage. Then, no, Caustic, right? Yeah, Mirage, Caustic. Oh, no, Bang. Bang's, uh, Bang was... Man. Yeah, Bang. Bang bang, I actually love Bang. I think she's like, I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna say it. I actually think Bang is like an A tier at the very least. A tier? Like, so let me let me let me break this down for you. One, she can shoot uh cover at the enemy and it does 10 damage. Uh so that you can they can shield you from any position, right? 
Two, yeah. she has uh, Rolling Thunder, which is, you know, her heavy artillery, whatever the fuck. Mm. Uh, one, that gets you out of a situation, or two, can push you straight into a situation, which is super fucking helpful. Three, she doesn't she doesn't even have to be shot at. She can double time and go the speed of, like, Octane for a she few seconds. She doesn't have to be shot at? What do you mean? I think she just has to be spotted. She said spotted double time, like, a lot. I, I, I have to really? look into that more, but... I mean, I've been playing Bang a lot, and you double time like the speed of Octane for a few seconds. Like yeah. that just feels really nice. Yeah, I know that's um, pretty fucking. Oh, it's really handy. helpful. Like sometimes when you double time, you like weave around the enemy like super easily too, so you don't have to run away. You can right. just run straight over them. And... Now I want to play her. <laughs> she's 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 really good, honestly. I, yeah. I love Bang. I think she's at least an A tier. Uh, yeah. I don't know how viable just, she is. For you like really got to know how to play her, though. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I've been playing a lot of Bang lately, so I guess it's mm-hmm. fair for me to do that. Honestly, no, her I, should be your next heirloom. Yeah, I was thinking about that. I kind of wanted to get it for Lifeline because I really like her no. uh, sticks, but I was like, you know, I think at this point it has to be Bangalore. Yeah, you never play Lifeline. You got to get Bangalores. Yeah. I can't believe you got uh, Rebs before Bangalore. Okay, well, listen, dude. Rebs oh, is event. really fucking cool. Yeah, and I, yeah. it was I got it on the event, so it's yeah. yeah. Um, Mirage. Mirage is slept on. I think he's pretty good, but I also don't think he's that good. I think in, in the hands of like a pro, Mirage can be like one of the best legends in the world. You can bamboozle left and fucking right and not know what the fuck just happened to you. Yeah, if, but also if, like if you're like pro level, like you're pretty good at spotting a decoy. True. So like not viable at all in comp, I'd say. Unless like it's like lower comp. Like if you're mm-hmm. if you're like grinding through like gold or something, Mirage is still a good character. Even maybe even plat, honestly. Um but anything above that, in tourneys especially, I don't think Barrage is the move. So yeah. that makes me want to put him at like a B with Wraith. I can agree with that. Yeah. In the right hands, he's pretty solid. With the yeah. invisible res, the ultimate. Um, What was his passive? Uh, I think it's the uh, resing while invisible. Oh, right, right, right. right. I, think yeah. that, I think that's his passive. Um, Caustic. Caustic is a piece of shit, and I hate him. He's just like fart Gibby. Man, fart man, fart man. Fart man. <laughs> yeah. I, yeah, I know. but he's pretty fucking handy, though. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. He just absorbs fucking damage, has his little fucking fart barrels. Yeah, I don't and know. the fact that he's not affected by other Caustics. Yeah. That's that just, pretty sick. Yeah. I think, I think like, that like i'd say a makes tier. him a yeah yeah just like, like he's not a gibby but he's definitely annoying mm-hmm. yeah the amount of times i've been fucked over by his ultimate like just easily he's solo ult. He, like he gets his ult really fast i think yeah jeez and like his barrels are handy as shit because they can trap people like they need to fucking uh, once it's like actually deployed and like shooting the gas, there's no way to get rid of it until the gas is gone, which is so fucking annoying. Right. But that makes him so fucking useful. Right. Well, yeah, it's here, sadly. Unfortunate. And next um, would be Octane. Octane right? is not as good as he was, but still decent. I fucking hate that they what nerfed his jump pad, dude. Yeah, I don't really feel like there is a reason to do that. Like I feel there like really it was wasn't. fine. Like making it louder, I understand, but making the distance shorter, fucking that, re- yeah, that makes so no stupid. sense. Like at least now you know you're being jumped, but like at the same time, like I mean, they they might honestly fall short, and you could still laser them. Like it's it it feels like yeah. a little bit. That feels like a weird nerf. I feel like they might revert it, honestly. Mm. Um, B tier. I don't know. B? From what he was, I think B. 
I'm, put, I'm putting like all my like some of my favorites in B. Yeah. This is depressing. I mean, B's not bad. It's not bad. It's just not an A. You know what I mean? Yeah. Watson not really viable for comp and stuff. Watson got stronger, and I think that actually I, like makes her. I go know she higher. got buffed, but I don't really know how. So I think she could put down more pylons, put them down faster, and she can and her. Uh, Pylon doesn't like just explode now when it's over. It just stays there forever. Has like a shield uh loot pool, so like it can heal up your shields as many times as it has left of shields to heal. Is what if that makes sense. So I honestly think she's like she's not lifeline, obviously, but I feel like she's a good defense now. Like she's actually been pretty fucking annoying. <laughs> Mm-hmm. I don't I know. Like I really don't have answers. problems with Watsons. I feel like I've been running into a so. fucking crazy amount of fences lately. Like, actually. I... Um, I don't know. Like, I, I'll see them, but I don't actually run in them. Well, no, I don't run into them, but, like, it's also impossible to get into a building that's been, like, fenced off completely. And then right. just sitting in the middle, completely safe with the pylon. Mm-hmm. So it's it's a tough, it's tough. I think she's like really good now, actually, for what she, she has is. that potential. Yeah. Season three crypto. I'm honestly, everyone knows it. Crypto is not <laughs> F tier because it can be useful, but definitely not a fucking D tier. We'll put the boy. No, in. I was gonna say C or D. <laughs> I uh, maybe I'll settle for fucking D, dude. There's crypto. Like, okay, not... Well, let's let's have a conversation debate about it. Crypto is not a like fun to play character in comp. I used to love playing him in comp. Like, he's okay, one like okay ish. But... Okay, so you can look at the fucking banner things that are around. See how many teams are nearby. He's good That's for pushing good. and like I don't know, just awareness. See, that's no. what I'm saying, though. So, his drones is stationary, and, like, it can, like, look at enemies from a certain angle, but you have to leave it at mm-hmm. that angle so that you can fight, right? So, there was, like, a good crypto buff idea to where the drone would follow crypto and, like, look behind him. So, that way he has, like, eyes on the back of his head. You know what I'm saying? So, like, if okay. a person, like, popped up, he'd know about it. It's, like, race awareness, but the drone actually scans them. And then he can whip it out, and it'll, like, it can EMP or something like that. Uh-huh. I think another cool thing would be having the ability to just EMP, like, where he stands. Like, why can't he do that? Sure, it affects him. But, I mean, it could just stun him. It doesn't have to take off his shields. You know what I'm saying? What do you mean, where he stands? So, like, instead of taking out the drone... Flying oh, it right, somewhere, right. then EMPing. Why not just activate your EMP on you, on your body? Um, I don't know, the drone has to be like deployed. Right, but yeah. why does the drone have to be deployed? Because the drone's the thing that does the EMPing. Right, but it's in your backpack anyway. So why not? It's just like in a sleep mode, EMP? though. Like it's all folded up, you know. Well, I'm saying that this is like a buff idea. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. Like if if you if you were able to like make the drone be his eyes in the back of his head, then you can make an EMP on the body too. Like mm-hmm. I don't think that's a horrible buff. I think that's right. I think that'd be perfect. I like his instant res uh stuff and his instant interaction yeah. stuff. The that's banner pickup. Handy. That's handy. But I mean, some sometimes more times than not, the team knows exactly where that crypto is doing that. No. So like, it's, it's so. been a lot of situations. I know. I think he's he's pretty handy, especially if you know how to use him. Like his EMP, someone has red shield, you can take them down to basically blue shield level. Right. Which just <clears throat> put a clip in them, they're done. You know. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. I don't know if he's... I don't think he's deserving of anything higher than a D, though. I don't think it gets him super far. Mm. 
Yeah, the only <laughs> real complaint I have about him is like how like people can just easily shoot down his drone. Yeah. Well, I mean, not a. I mean, kinda. It's hard to mm-hmm. shoot down his drone if he's moving, but I mean, while it that can be. What I do when he's trying to annoy the fucking team with his drone like that is I just look for crypto. Like, yeah. I, he's not going to be able, he's not doing anything. He's just like moving around his drone thinking he's doing something, but you just look for crypto. Yeah. And then he's like, oh shit, that one's coming towards me. Hop out of the drone. Okay, now I know I'm actually close. You know what I mean? I guess. Yeah. Um, Revenant. I think Revenant is pretty good. I don't think. I actually Revenant's think pretty good. Revenant's like pretty pretty good. Yeah, like I, I think. Yeah, he's... I love his buff where he can climb shit so much easier. Yeah, I I genuinely think he's like an A tier, just because of if I'm if I can, I would like to include his heirloom into this. <laughs> his mm-hmm. heirloom is really fucking sick. Uh, his buff is really cool. He can climb into. He can climb up like uh like literal skyscrapers now which is awesome uh-huh. um i think that's what really makes him like viable now is how high he can climb and then his death totem range is awesome but i also don't like how everyone knows there's a death totem now yeah yeah like the other day when we were playing i saw like the death totem like shockwave thing from like yeah for half, half, a, half the map away i swear yeah, it was, it's a that's it's a exactly really big good. sign. No, that's probably not exaggerating. Like you can see it like, pretty far. It was it was really big, but I don't know. I don't think he's A tier. I'd say B, because yeah, his totem's cool, but it's it's honestly so easy to take care of those fucking zombies or what do you call them? Yeah, shadows. Yeah, shadows. I mean, I I agree with that, but I disagree with that. Like, it just like I said, it takes a skilled player just to fucking bob and weave with that extra life. That's it. Mm-hmm. And like, it also depends on how far the totem is. You can fuck him up immediately after you took some health off. Yeah. Like, I feel like he's really really strong, but I mean, I'll agree with you and say B tier simply because of the. Uh, the explosion that it shows when mm-hmm. when you do it down to yeah. one two and his three, silence four, five, are, six, are pretty fucking handy like oh they're really handy they're very oh. very handy taking away uh, loba. Some abilities loba i'd say also b tier yeah maybe a i don't know no. black market <laughs> very useful her bracelet can be tough to use and it's kind of a what's the word not crutch handicap i actually really the amount of times that i've lasered a loba coming out of her bracelet teleport ridiculous yeah it's just i mean now it's well now it's a little i mean you can't be dumb with loba though there's a lot of dumb people that push with the bracelet you're only supposed to push yeah. with the bracelet if you're pushing into cover with the bracelet yeah like and they can't get to you that fast or like, like say through a window you know i've done that when loba came out i was throwing it through windows left and right and it was like it would actually right. fuck up teams and that's mm-hmm. why i like loba but i don't think she's a uh I don't think she's much higher than B tier right now. Yeah. B for sure. And, uh, fused. Oh, Fuse? And... Wait, what are you saying? Wait. Oh! Uh... Was it Fuse Horizon or Rampart? It was Rampart. Rampart with Season 6. Rampart with Season 6? Okay, yeah. Uh, Rampart, yeah, yeah, she yeah. got her buff and it was fun, but I don't think she's like she's <laughs> higher than crypto, but she's she's still alright. Meh. I mean, those, they're, those they're shields really are pretty annoying. Power. Yeah, her shields are actually annoying all of a sudden. Yeah, mm-hmm. and they have a good amount of fucking health. Like, you know once what? they're actually up. Y- yeah, you know what? I feel like that, I feel like that runs her into a B. Maybe. Maybe an S actually. Let me think about this. So like, no. So you have, so you have like a charge sentinel. She's forded up, and she could pull out Sheila at any point in time. 
I feel, and she has her LMG passive. Like, she might actually be, like, deadly, deadly. And I think she's one of the better defenses. She's better than Watson. Yeah. Which I, I think wouldn't so. say S, though. She's not, not S. S. She's A, maybe. A or B. I think, no. I think I'll, I'm gonna think I'm gonna throw in A, actually. That's... It's kind of curveball, honestly. I was not expecting to put Rampart in A. I wasn't expecting it either, but I, I just thought about it. Yeah. <laughs> Horizon's not super great anymore. I don't think she's like super, super viable for a team. Her ult is kind of good, but everyone just shoots it now. Right. Like the um, more space you have to play, the less effective her ult is. Yeah. I don't know. It's it's really good if you're like loaded up on nades though. Right. If you have a fuse with your ring of fire, you can help out, but like I don't know what else. Mm. I don't know. Like say like say with crypto, do um what lift on horizons or ult them or lift on her lift, ult them, EMP them. Chuck a shit ton of nades. I think the EMP breaks her ult. You can't break uh, your teammate's stuff. Pretty right? sure you can. Yeah, I'm pretty sure you can. Yeah, like, you can't shoot Octane's jump pad unless you're actually the one that put it. Well, yeah, but I think you can... Um, I'm, pretty, I'm thinking that you can EMP it is what I'm saying. I think EMP is a different mm -hmm. thing. I don't know. We'd I have don't know. to test it. Yeah. We'll test oh, it. Yeah. So Horizon <laughs> C tier? Honestly, yeah. I right, cause she just goes straight up, man. Like I, I don't yeah. know. She's evasive. Yeah, what they, they the... nursed they nerfed like her movement on the grav lift too. Yeah. So she's But also when she's on that grav lift, it's pretty fucking hard to hit her. It is. And that's why I think she's deserving of a C. It's like the same as Path. Like Path is like she's really that character that you use to like push a team, mm -hmm. just like get damage in really, even if you don't win. Yeah. And then yeah, came Fuse. Cool. Fuse is Fuse is B. B. No. B. D. B. I. B. I've still never received a single fuse win on either of my accounts, and I genuinely think he's a B, uh, simply because one, he can spam his knuckle cluster that lasts like what two fucking minutes? I don't fucking know. His <laughs> ring of fire has actually been handy dandy for him lately, and on this map, which you would think would be a nerf because of all the open space, it's actually like dead on hits and like stopping you where you stand kind of stuff. I think that's just people getting better with him, but right. him himself, I don't know. What was his? Oh, his passive is just holding more nades, right? Right. It's um, nade spammer. Um, I think he's about as useful as Horizon and Path, though. Maybe. I, I You could probably argue that. See. I mean, I can't yeah. put anyone below crypto. I I literally can't. <laughs> uh, yes. Valkyrie, I'm just going to do it. Immediate A tier. Yeah. Agreed. She's absolutely really good. Gets her teammate out of situations. Uh, fucking gets herself into... The scan, the like, fucking um, rockets, the flying. Yeah, she's still super, super good. And I love her. Um, that's not even up for debate. That's just, that's even what a pro would say, honestly. Well, she's Asian with cheeks, so. Yeah, there you go. Uh, Seer, good, but not, mm -hmm. not that. He's good. getting a buff. Is he getting a buff? Yeah, so his tactical, the, the whoosh boom thing. Right, I right. think they're shortening the time it takes for it to, like, actually detonate. Oh yeah, so like by yeah, so they're just reverting seconds, it. Though. Yeah, they're like reverting it back. Yeah, which I think will be good because whenever I play him, 
and like I use his tactical. Yeah, they have. And it time seems like I have it now. like dead on on the person. Somehow they're able to realize they're in it and then get out of it just barely in enough time to not be hit. Right. So, so I that think really needs to speed up. I feel like he's a B. B. Yeah, his ult super Alone handy. Alone. His heartbeat super handy. And if I had to say a DPS was deserving of an S tier, it's probably Ash. S tier. I think she's S tier. Cause like her her uh her whatever you want to call it, dimensional cut or whatever the heck. Yeah. Um it's just so handy for the team. It gets you out of any mm. immediate, immediate situations. Her snare is super handy for lasering a person, getting them out of the team, just getting them out of the game pretty fucking fast if all your teammates yeah, are. Yeah, you can do some pretty nutty it. plays with her. Yeah, she's she's really fucking handy. Plus, it does like what twenty damage? I think. I think so. Yeah. Her snare? That's like crazy. I think. Is that? I think that might be if you hit them dead on. Um. I don't know how much it is if it just lands near them. I think it's less. Right. But I think this yeah, is where everybody stands right here. I, I um, think this is where everyone is. Do we want to do any revisions? I feel like we don't have a lot of S tier. I thought there would be more S tiers. Yeah, I don't think anyone's like that deserving of S tier. Like Valk yeah. is good, but she's also really easy to laser out of the sky. Like Honestly, that the S tier, I think that's a solid team. Yeah, honestly, fuck. If only we had a good Gibby. I fucking hate Gibby, though. I mean, I could try Gibby. No, don't try Gibby. Like I, I have ult. respect for you. I don't want you to be Gibby. <laughs> I mean, dude, his <laughs> ult, fucking nasty. His dome shield, handy as fuck. But all the, the other shield, day... Handy as fuck. The other day when I threw down his dome, somehow a nade fucking hit me. Maybe I was like barely peeking out the edge of it and it hit me and it fucking knocked me. I don't because you can't throw stuff into the dome shield, right? You could not. No. Yeah. So I don't know. I don't know. That's weird. I just, I you just got to figure out how to play him and then he's fucking great. And you got to somehow get over the fact that he's slow as shit. Apparently he's not. Yeah, he is. Everyone, everyone keeps saying that he's that everyone's the same speed. It just seems like he's slow. No, Gibby is slower. Um, Caustic's the one that seems slower, but is the same speed. Interesting. I'm pretty sure, like eighty percent sure. Well, I can't wait to make a thumbnail for this one, but uh, I think that's I think that's honestly the list. I don't yeah. think there's any revisions to be done. It's a little upsetting that you put crypto in D, because I used to really like crypto. He's just but... not he's not viable in this day and age of legends. <sighs> Sad face. Yeah. Alright. Well, that's the tier list, guys. That's the tier list. <laughs>